Hi everyone, I'm Jennifer from English with Jennifer. Let's study basic English together. You can learn with my students, Flavia and Andrea, as we review the past tense. When you learn vocabulary, learn words that go together. A group of words is a phrase. For example, tea is one word. Drink tea is a phrase. Drink hot tea is a longer phrase. Do you know these phrases? Drink tea. Cup of tea. A hot cup of tea. Make a cup of tea. Tea with sugar. Tea with honey. Tea with lemon. Study these phrases. Then it will be easier to talk about tea. You can tell me about your morning, for example. I woke up early today and made a cup of tea. I drank tea with lemon. Listen as I talk with Flavia and Andrea. We're going to review vocabulary and words that go together. They go together in common phrases. These common phrases are also called collocations. How are the cats? <laughs> Five. But this is three. Oh, wow. The cats are happy. Yeah. <laughs> they yes. have energy. <laughs> How are you, Flavia? No, I didn't do it. All right. Yeah. Okay. I have the bag again. Mm -hmm. There are some old things mm -hmm. and some new things. Let's see if you remember some of the old things. <laughs> Andrea, what's this? Fork. Oh, yes. <laughs> this time, when I say, what's this? You say, it's a fork. And then think of something that maybe we did yesterday. Mm -hmm. so it's a fork. And I'll ask, what did you do yesterday? I ate spaghetti. Mm -hmm. Right? Like, what did you do with the fork? I mm -hmm. ate spaghetti. Okay? Mm -hmm. So, what's this? Uh, it's a spoon. It's a spoon. What did you do yesterday? I ate a soup. I ate soup. Okay. Too bad I don't have chopsticks. <laughs> so, okay. What's this? Uh, pencil. 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 What did you do yesterday? I writing. I wrote. I mm. wrote. I wrote. I wrote a letter. I wrote notes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What else can you do with a pencil? We can, like, if I I can draw a cat. Yeah. I yeah. can draw mm -hmm. a rainbow. Mm -hmm. right. What did you do yesterday? I draw. Draw. Drew. Oh yeah. Yes. Yeah. What yeah. did you do? I drew uh, a house. I drew a house. <laughs> <laughs> okay. um, what's this? A knife. A knife. What did you do yesterday? I cut. I cut uh, salad. <laughs> I cut lettuce. I cut vegetables. Yeah. Okay. okay. Something here. What's this? A uh, bomb. Mm -hmm. What did you do yesterday? I play. I play. I played. Uh, you can just, I played. I played. <laughs> I played with the dog, right? I yeah. played with the dog. There are two more things you can do with the ball. Well, actually, a few more things, but you can throw it. Throw. What did you do yesterday? It's like draw. Draw, drew, True. throw, True. threw. Through. With that th, through. <laughs> Always difficult. <laughs> Do the th, and now the r. Through. Through. Good. Uh -huh. Through. What did you do? I threw. I, I threw, threw the ball. I threw the ball. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And you can catch the ball. Mm. What did you do yesterday? I got. Very caught the ball. I caught the ball. I threw the ball and I caught the ball. Mm -hmm. Okay, say it. Through. Through. Caught. Caught. Okay, good. Uh, you can also 
bounce. <laughs> bounce. Bounce. The, bounce. So I bounced the ball. Bounce. It's just a bounce. Yeah. Bounce. 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 Bounced. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. The cats are playing. <laughs> um, what's this? Um, it's kind of the same, like the same thing you do to your teeth. Oh, a brush. 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 It's a brush. It's a very mm -hmm. little brush. It's for yeah. my purse. <laughs> what did I do yesterday? I brushed my hair. I brushed my hair. Brushed. Or you say you brushed your hair. You brushed brush. Your hair. Brushed. <coughs> brushed. Mm -hmm. I brushed my hair. I brushed my hair. <laughs> do you know what this is? Mm -hmm. What's this? Can. It's a can of. Can of. It's a can of soup. Can of soup. Mm -hmm. You can say, of course, I ate soup yesterday, but first, what did I do? I opened. Good, I opened. I opened a the can. can. And then? And then I ate it. Well, you don't want to eat it out of the can. <coughs> that wouldn't taste good. I put, <laughs> mm -hmm. I put in the pot. The pot. You can put soup in the pot, and then what do you do on the stove? What do you do with the soup? You want to make it hot. Uh, uh, what do you uh, warm? Do? War you can say warm or cook, cook. or make, uh -huh. right? What did you do yesterday? I cooked. I cooked soup, or I made soup. I made soup. I made soup. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. You can say yesterday I cooked. I cooked. But with soup, we often say make. Make soup. I made soup. I mm. made soup. What did you do yesterday? I made soup. I made soup. I made soup. Okay. What's this? Uh, it's a book. And what did you do yesterday? I read a book. I read a book. Mm -hmm. Here's a different kind of book. What kind of book is this? A book of Music. Music. A book of music. What did I do yesterday? You studied. Maybe I studied music, but for fun, I like to play the piano. Yesterday I played. Played the piano. Played the piano. Good. Okay. Um, what are these? Scissors. And what scissors? Scissors. What did I do yesterday? Uh, you cut your paper? Mm -hmm. I cut paper, you cut paper. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you know what's in here? Different things. Mm -hmm. Do you know what this is? Uh, sleep, uh, sleep lip. Lip. Lip lipstick. Lipstick, right? It's lip makeup, right? What do we do with makeup? We put on makeup. Mm -hmm. Put on. Mm -hmm. What did you do yesterday? I put on. Uh, makeup. I put on makeup. I put on makeup. Good. I think there's one more. Oh, I can do a couple. Do you remember what this is? Uh, it's, a eraser. it's an eraser. It's an eraser and we can erase. Uh, erase. Right? I can write and then erase words. I erase. I can erase a word. Erase. Erase. Mm -hmm. erase. What did you do yesterday? I uh, erased. I erased words. <laughs> right. First you write, then you can uh -huh. erase. I erased mistakes on the paper. Uh -huh. um, what different and um, uh, erase it? Mm -hmm. uh, um, oh. Nothing. Anything? Oh, I erased the message. Uh, like on a computer? Yes. That's also. delete. Delete. Right. On a computer we delete. Mm -hmm. With this, we erase. I can erase mm. with this eraser, and I can erase with this. When I write with pencil, I erase. Mm -hmm. On the computer, we delete. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. So I can delete a message. <coughs> Yesterday, I... Del deleted. Very good. Deleted, because delete ends with that T, mm -hmm. so we get the extra syllable. Deleted. deleted. Like started. I deleted the message. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay. Um, oh, I'm going to do one more. <laughs> do you remember oh, whose turn is it? Is your turn? Elastic. Elastic. We can put our <laughs> hair up. Right? Um, we put our hair up with an elastic, or we use an elastic. 
And what do we make with an elastic? I made a uh, ponytail. A ponytail. ponytail. I made a ponytail. I would say I put my hair up in a ponytail. Uh, I, put I put my hair up in a ponytail. I put my hair up. In a ponytail. In a ponytail. Or I put my hair in a ponytail. Mm -hmm. um, I used an elastic and I put my hair in a ponytail. Mm -hmm. I put my hair in a ponytail, I put my hair up in a ponytail. Doesn't mm -hmm. matter. But you used an elastic. Good. Okay. Um, was there anything new? Study these phrases. These are words that go together. Say them aloud with me. Eat with a fork. Use a fork. Eat with a spoon. Use a spoon. Cut with a knife. Cut vegetables. Cut meat. Write a letter. Write notes. Draw a picture. Throw a ball. Catch a ball. Bounce a ball. Brush my hair. Brush my teeth. Can of soup. Make soup. Read a book. Play the piano. Put on makeup. Wear makeup. Put on lipstick. Wear lipstick. Erase a word. Erase a mistake. Delete a word. Delete a mistake. Delete an email. Delete a message. Put your hair up. Put your hair up in a ponytail. Put your hair in a ponytail. Now go back and change all the verbs to the past tense. When you're ready, go on with the lesson. We're going to practice more past tense verbs. So we have three groups of verbs I want to practice for pronunciation. I want you to listen and repeat. The first group, the verbs are regular verbs. The ending sounds like T. Right? Because all of the verbs end with that voiceless consonant sound, like p, k, s, sh, k, f, all quiet. So we end with T. Okay, let's take turns reading. Flavia, you begin with the first sentence. I want you to change that word, the verb, to the past tense. Not I stop at the red light, I stop it. stopped. Mm -hmm. Read it, please. I stop it at the red light. Next. Next. Mm -hmm. Change I, walk. I I walked to school. Good. I missed it. I missed you. Missed you. Missed you. Good. I brushed my teeth. Great. Uh, we talked on the phone. Very good. She lo she logged. No. Laugh. Left. Good. She laughed loud. loudly. 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 She laughed loudly. Good. She laughed loudly. Nice. Again, these drills are something you can practice too. And mm -hmm. record yourself and listen. Do you hear the T? Right? You can also note some useful phrases in that exercise. Stop at the red light. Walk to school. Talk on the phone. Laugh loudly. 
Again, we have that nice d sound, d, because all of those verbs end with the voiced consonant, v, d, n, right? Or they end with a vowel sound, right? Like oi, e, o. They're all voiced, we, so we add on a d sound, okay? We'll change the sentences. I move becomes I moved. Moved, not moved, moved. Moved. Good. Mm -hmm. Next. I enjoyed the weather. Good. I loved Boston. Good. She opened the door. Mm -hmm. I turned my head. Mm -hmm. I carried the groceries. Groceries home? Mm -hmm. I carried the groceries home. I carried the groceries home. Good. He showed, showed, showed. She, uh, <coughs> he showed my fo my photos. Uh huh. He showed, but um, if he has photos, then he showed them to me. Remember, we talked about. You can say he showed the photos to me. He showed me photos. Mm -hmm. He showed me photos. Yeah. He showed me photos. Good. Mm -hmm. It uh, rained hard. Good. It rained hard. Yeah. One more time. Repeat after me. Mm -hmm. Um, together, moved, moved, enjoyed, enjoyed, loved, loved, opened, opened, opened turned, 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 carried, carried, showed, showed, showed rained, rained. Very nice. Do you feel the difference? And then let's try this. Um, stopped, walked, stopped, walked, moved, enjoyed, moved, enjoyed, missed, brushed. Missed, brushed. Loved, opened. Loved, opened. Very good, because now we're going back and forth. T, D, mm -hmm. T, D. Good. <laughs> Here are more phrases to remember. Enjoy the weather. Open the door. Turn my head. Carry the groceries. Show photos. Group C. Now we have an extra syllable because these verbs end with a T or a D sound, right? Mm -hmm. Not start, but started, right? Mm -hmm. Change the verbs again to the past tense. Mm -hmm. She? She started a new job. Good. They visit my in the summer. Visited. Me. Visit. Visited. They visited me in the summer. Great. Uh, we wanted a cold drink. He he waited for the bus. I needed more time. We decided quickly. We decided. We decided quickly. Very nice. Okay. Mm -hmm. Repeat after me. Started. 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 Visited. 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 Wanted, wanted, waited, waited, needed, needed, decided, decided. Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. Cool. Yes. You can keep these. <laughs> Practice. Okay. Uh -huh. And record yourself if you can. Get your phone, record, uh -huh. and listen. Yeah. Do you hear the three groups? T, d, uh -huh. and the extra syllable. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. Good. Again, let's note some useful phrases. Start a new job. Want a cold drink? Have a cold drink. Wait for the bus. Need more time. Decide quickly. Why do we learn common phrases? Why do we learn collocations? First, we want to sound natural when we speak English. We want to put words together in a way most other people put words together. Second, when you know only words, it takes time to put them together in a sentence. When you know whole phrases, you can make a sentence faster. It's like building with bigger blocks. So remember to learn common phrases when you learn new vocabulary. How do people use that word? Listen for the phrases they use. That's all for now. Please like and share this video with others learning English. 
As always, thanks for watching and happy studies. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Check out my videos on Instagram. And don't forget to subscribe.